this morning to tell my story. My story goes back to the early 80s, when I almost lost my life working for a local company in the Harrisburg area. And as the years have gone by, I've become more compelled to get more involved with safety. I like to tell this story because I feel that it can help someone else. Because I would never want to ever see what happened to me happen to anybody. Never in life. How many of you here this morning have done things, anything, whether it be at home, work, driving down the road, that you know it wasn't right, but you did it anyway? How many? Everybody do things at one time or another that's not right. But I raised my hand, I raised two of them because I did. I admit to it. Most people won't admit to that. I want you to do something for me. I see a lot of faces in here, a lot of the faces I've seen before in classes that I've done before. I want everybody to take their hand and hold it up in the air like this here. Hold your hand up in the air. Just like, come on, everybody, work with me now. Work with me. What I want you to do with your hand, I want you to take your hand and put it down on your chin. Now, why did you put your hand on your cheek? Where did I tell you to put it? Where did I tell you to put your hand? Chin. Chin. Is this your chin? If this is your chin, you guys are telling me you got some pretty messed up looking faces. <laughs> the point of that is, and this is very, very powerful, because you did what you see me do, not what I told you to do. We have foremen on the jobs who give instructions. You want to make sure when you give those instructions, you give the right instructions. Because what you told me today is, if you saw me stick my finger in the socket, you are likely to do it too. You are likely to do the same thing. One of the reasons why I like to do that is because when I had my accident, a lot of people said, gee, that was dumb. I would have never done that. But a lot of people did this. When I said, do, do this. You guys get that? December 3rd, 1980. I went to work one day. It was almost Christmas time, and I was happy. I was so happy because I had all of the toys and all of the gifts for my family. I didn't have to worry about any of that stuff. I worked for one of the largest corporations in the, in, in the United States of America. It had 150,000 employees. Big company. But I was happy. Had all my toys and gifts and didn't have to worry about that. Got a service call that day. There was no heat. Me being happy driving down the road. Do, 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 do. I get to the job site. The customer takes me to the mechanical room and shows me the board that wasn't functioning. 